Oh hi, thanks for watching my video. So today we are back in the trash bag dad household because I feel like in the, the last video we made quite a lot of progress. Trash bag dad proved me wrong, didn't he? Worked pretty hard selling paintings, but we didn't quite manage to do everything I'd like to do. So we're back with the trash bag dad family. Hopefully we're gonna be able to make a few changes today, set this family up for success so I can just leave them behind knowing that they'll live a happy life. So in the first video, trash bag dad was kind of useless, didn't really do much, but then he did complete 180, got a job as an artist, started painting, selling paintings. He overcame his alcoholism. You can see there, quit drinking. He even left the crack well alone, and he's gained the entrepreneurial skill. So things are looking pretty bright for Trash Bag Dad. I'm thinking in this episode, we're going to go with what he started doing in terms of making money. So he's going to be the main breadwinner. And we're going to make a few improvements to the house. We're not going to do like I have done with families in the past that have like upgraded their homes. We're not going to go luxury. We're just going to make a few minor improvements, you know? Like I mentioned, the mum died just as they started doing renovations. So I think it would be nice if Trash Bag Dad can maybe earn enough money to finish the renovations that they had always planned to do. So maybe we'll give the girls bedrooms, a fresh look of paint, some clean carpet. Maybe we'll pull the living room out, add a little dining area, new bathroom. Trash Bag Dad's bedroom needs a renovation, that's for sure. So yeah, Trash Bag Dad, his goals for today are making money, trying to upgrade the house, and I'm thinking maybe at some point we'll get him a nice little button-up shirt and we'll send him speed dating, see if he can meet someone else. Tori did pretty well in the last episode. She ended with an A grade, so I don't really have any goals for her. She can just live her life, maybe try and make some friends, I don't know. Sophia is going to have a bit of work to do. So I did say in the last episode that what I might do with her is get her to graduate high school early and get a job, like a full-time job. I've sort of changed my mind on that. I think because I want Trash Bag Dad to be the main earner, we're not going to go with that plan now with Sophia. Instead, her goals are going to be all about getting scholarships. So in today's video, we want to get Sophia in a position where she's been accepted, where she's been granted even at least three scholarships so that she can apply to go to university. And I'd quite like her to do a distinguished degree as well. I feel like that would be quite a good step, you know, start off in quite a sad household, everyone's depressed. How good would it be if Trash Bag Dad meets someone new and Sophia gets into a distinguished degree with some financial help? Be a real happy story. And I'm thinking, seeing as she already has the skills in it, I might get her to try and go for a, like a culinary degree. But to do all of that, we need a computer and we can't really afford one right now. So Trash Bag Dad, maybe you could get painting. Use the picture of your dead wife as inspiration. Oh, stop crying, Trash Bag Dad. Emotional meltdown. <laughs> you'll be fine, you'll be fine. Just carry on with your painting. What level painting did he get to? Level six, pretty high. And then maybe, Sophia, you can, instead of practicing research and debate, maybe you could practice cooking. Like, cook a grand meal, like a ham dinner. What level cooking is she? Level five, okay, yeah. So if she gets, like, level six or level seven, I reckon that'll definitely put her in a good standing for a distinguished degree. Hopefully Trash Bag Dad's painting will sell for enough to buy a computer. Oh, is that all it was worth? 500? How are your needs doing? Oh, they're fine. Okay, well then, do another one. Make it worth a bit more money this time, Trash Bag Dad. Yeah, I think I might just drag this wall in line with Trash Bag Dad's bedroom, and then I'll have a little square space here, put a dining table. And then if Trash Bag Dad does meet someone while speed dating, he can invite them over for dinner, Sophia could cook. Why are you throwing a strop? Huh? Grow up. Level six of the cooking skill. Okay, there we go. So we've got enough for a computer now at least. Oh, they've got this in their household inventory. I can only assume it was gifted to Trash Bag Dad for his hard work in painting. So I'll put that up in his bedroom. Oh, you know what? Streamer's first computer. I know it's a bit more expensive, but as well as because uh, Sophia already has a job in the culinary career, but maybe she could bring in a little bit extra cash as well by doing a cheeky bit of streaming. 
Okay, well, it's Saturday, so I'm guessing... Okay, no, Trash Bag Dad has got work. What career level is he at? Level three. Maybe we'll see if we can get him to, like, level five. Sophia, do you have work today? No. Okay, good. Okay, we're gonna get a job as a streamer. I'm not sure if she could do both jobs at the same time. I don't think so. Because I think with high school years, you're able to do an after-school activity and a part-time job. But I don't know if you can do two part-time jobs at the same time. I think probably not. Oh, I just noticed Trash Bag Dad has, like, the best possible relationship with his kids. That is so sweet, Trash Bag Dad. Yeah, I think what I'm gonna do is, um, we're not gonna go for the streamer career. It's kind of annoying that you can't just stream on the computer without that side job. But yeah, I don't want her to become a streamer because you get a scholarship if you are at, like, the top ranking in a, the part-time job, and I don't want to lose that scholarship. In fact, when you finish doing your homework there, Sophia, we're gonna get you to enrol. We're gonna get you to apply for some scholarships. And you know what, Trash Bag Dad? You go, you go to work, boy. You go to work. Maybe you'll... Oh, well, you won't come back with a promotion, but... You know, set yourself up for success. And then, Sophia, you could take a shit and then apply for scholarships. Pretty sure there's another scholarship you can get, which is just based on where you live as well. Oh, Sophia's responsible. Good, good. Well done. I'm not sure if they would qualify for the low-income one. I don't know. I've set a goal of three scholarships, but, I mean, we're gonna try and go for as many as we can. Who knows? We might end up getting, like, six. Six or seven. Okay, okay. So we, it looks like we might actually qualify for the low income one as well. Well, let's just apply for all four. So we'll also go for food and drink because of the skills we have. Oh, Trash Bag Dad apparently got a big performance gain. Yeah, we'll also go for the workplace one and then the Oasis Springs one. Why can't you multi-select scholarships? There we go, we've applied for four. So hopefully we can get at least three of them. What's wrong, Soph? You tired? Go get some sleep. How's Tori doing? Also tired. Okay. Well, it's 11 a.m., so bedtime. All right. Good job, Trash Bag Dad. Let's do a sad painting, see if we can make some money. Oh, you've got a want chat with Libby. Who's Libby? Is she a work colleague that you have a crush on or something? Libby Dursley. Why does that name ring a bell? I'm not sure who that is. I know that's definitely one of my sims. But I don't know, I can't see her profile, so I can't figure out if she has, like, a family. Well, maybe we'll send her a text when you finish your painting. Oh, Serena's calling. Or texting. Typical. Soon as we start moving on, soon as we find someone we actually like, dead wife tries to intervene. Oh, that is such a sad painting. Look, you've got the tears and everything. That's the standard we're going with now, is it? A toddler could do that, trash bag dad. So that's it then. That is shit. And, uh, well, apparently it's excellent. <laughs> Sell to an art gallery, there you go. And then text that chick you've got a crush on. Well, we have a few days before Sophia has work. Trash Bag Dad has a few days off as well. So maybe I'll just get him to sell some paintings and then just keep an eye on his needs. We might try and use the weekend to see if we can get some money together to do a few renovations, maybe. Why are you in a mood? Oh, missing out on dreams. Don't be annoyed with me, because you're missing out on dreams, Sophia. You're lucky. You could have been in an inbreeding challenge. Or worse, an extreme genetics one. I could have done some horrific things to you, Sophia. You know what I'm not hearing? Grateful. At least Trash Bag Dad knows how lucky he is. I gave him a shit situation, expected him to be a waste of space, and he proved me wrong. She's quite hungry. Maybe I'll get her to... I'm just gonna have her cook a grand meal. A grand meal every time she's hungry. And that way it'll take her longer to cook and then she'll build that cooking skill even faster. Right, should we make some resolutions then? Your resolution will be... Raise a skill. Trash bag dad, I know exactly what your resolution is going to be. Get a significant other. And then Sophia, maybe we'll see if there's something on here for like go to college or something. Hmm, okay, well then, let's just go for raise a skill then for you. Right, let's call everyone to the grand meal and then we can all join in on the countdown to midnight. Oh, Vlad, nice to see you. All right, everyone, we saw in the new year, let's go to bed. 
ready for a new day of selling paintings and maybe doing some upgrades tomorrow. Oh, Ghost Mum came in to do the cleaning. She seems less aggressive than last time. I wonder how she's going to take it when Trash Bag Dad's uh, potential significant other starts hanging around. Oh, Trash Bag Dad's woken up inspired, taking himself to go and do a painting. So proactive. All right, Sophia, we'll go check the progress on your scholarships. I doubt anything would have changed because it's not even been 24 sim hours. But, you know, we'll check. We'll check. Still pending. All right, we have a little bit of money. I mean, not enough to go crazy, but enough to do a couple of things. Like maybe pull this wall out a little bit. That's right. Okay, so now we have more living room space. Maybe we'll move the dining table over there. Maybe we will increase the size of this bedroom so we don't have that annoying hallway. Okay, that looks a bit better. Maybe we'll give the bedrooms like fresh carpets. Just make the space look a little bit cleaner. Also, we desperately need a new bathroom. There we go, nothing too flashy, just a nice bathroom that has just enough bathroom stuff in it to look like it's fairly well furnished. Although now we do just have one simoleon, so trash bag dad, how about we do some painting? They did have one simoleon, but then <laughs> Sophia had a load of fruit in her inventory, so I just sold all that so we can afford to actually make a painting. Hey kid, go and have a bath. You stink. And then Sophia, with your spare time, maybe we'll cook another grand meal, grand breakfast. Why are you trolling the forums? You don't need to do that. And yet the sim that I thought was going to save the day, Sophia, ends up getting high at school, trolling the forums. Terrible. <gasps> Trash Bag Dad has finished painting a masterpiece. Oh, shut up. Oh, well done. Well done, Trash Bag Dad. Why don't you do another one now that you're very confident? Let's see if you can rustle up another masterpiece. Okay, well you can take a shit after you sell that painting. That was really good. We've got a big chunk of change now. I might just see what kind of improvements I can make. Well, first things first, we don't really need any of this like table clutter. So let's just get rid of that. And maybe we'll get a slightly nicer coffee table. Okay, and then we'll get this TV. Oh, it's quite expensive just size it up okay the living room's looking quite nice I'm kind of happy with how this looks I might change the color of the couch though maybe we'll just go for that orange color maybe we'll uh, we'll redo trash bag dad's walls all right that will do for now his bedroom's definitely not finished yet but you know I quite like doing it this way you know just doing little bits bit by bit just slowly making progress, you know? Hey, trash bag, why don't you go do a painting? Why are you angry? Losing control. Ugh. Sophia, you need to go check in with yourself. Calm down. Sophia, familial distress. I just need to escape the family. So what do you do? You go and stand right next to your dad while he's trying to concentrate. Oh, sweet. Sophia got some scholarships. She was awarded one for education for all and awarded one for food and drink. She didn't get the workplace scholar one. Why the fuck not? Oh, man. Okay, well, then we're going to find another job instead and see if we can find another way to get that third scholarship. Let's try the video game streamer one. Oh, you can just use a picture of yourself now. Okay, that will be my avatar. Just a picture of her. I mean, maybe if I earn enough through streaming, she'll gain a high enough video gaming skill to maybe try and get another skill-based scholarship for video gaming. Oh, that one's worth over a thousand. <gasps> another masterpiece. Oh, trash bag, dad. I always only get masterpieces when I'm doing a figure painting. That seems to be the only time my Sims create them. <gasps> no way. No way, Trash Bag Dad, did you just make another fucking masterpiece? Oh my god. You're on a roll, Trash Bag Dad. Well, you know what? I think you've earned a brand new bedroom. Maybe we'll even have enough left over to redo the girls' rooms as well. I think maybe we'll go for some candles. Okay, I think that will do for Trash Bag Dad's bedroom. 
And then the kids room, I kind of like the colours she's got, the pink and purple, so we'll keep that all the same. Maybe we'll just give her some more toys and stuff. I didn't even give her a toy box. Whoops. Okay, there you go, little toy box at the end of your bed. And then maybe a little doll's house as well. I think that will do for the kids bedroom. I feel like there's maybe a bit too much going on with this wallpaper. <laughs> maybe we'll just try and break it up with a few things on the wall. Okay, pretty happy with that. They even have a few hundred simoleons spare. Well, I would consider the house renovation done. So basically all there is left to do now is get trash bag dad like a nice shirt, nice pair of jeans so he can go on a date and then figure out how we can get Sophia that last scholarship. In fact, Sophia, you should be working on your video game skill right now. And trash bag dad, we're gonna get you dressed. Trash bag dad needs an, a new look and that is for sure. Like this. This is quite nice, quite arty. Or maybe something like this. I think I prefer this one actually. We'll wear this and then maybe some nice jeans. Oh yeah, trash bag dad, the ladies are gonna love you. Okay, well let's see if we can go, maybe tonight we'll go speed dating. Okay. All right, trash bag dad, let's go dating. Okay, we will do a speed date. Single, ready to mingle, come speed date. This is uh, one of Kiara Sims mods, I think. Single woman. Oh, it's just gonna be the two of us? Oh, I thought it was gonna be like, you know, you go through multiple in one at one time. Well, we'll ask Libby. And maybe we'll just go to the gnome's arms just for a, a drink. I mean, we're not looking to get a relationship out of this right now, maybe in the future, but you know, we just wanna start dating, break the ice a little bit, you know, get used to talking to other women. Oh, you uh, decided not to wear any clothes there, Libby? That's pretty forward, but okay. I guess I could introduce myself. I wonder if she's single. Oh, she's my neighbor. Doesn't say anything about a husband or a wife. So how about we order our favorite drink? Trash bag dad, what the fuck are you wearing? Get back changed into your normal clothes. Spent all that time trying to make you look dapper. And maybe we could ask Libby about her day. I mean, she's not wearing any clothes, so I assume she must have had a hell of a day. I'm just gonna say, you look like you've had a crazy day. And then she will say, you don't know the half of it. <laughs> No, I think it'd be good for Trash Bag Dad to start a relationship with someone who's out there. Hey, you, fuck off, mate. Stepping on my toes. Should we try flirting? Oh no, things are turning boring. Oh no. There are many levels of romance. Try out various romantic social. Yeah, okay, thanks for the hint, game. I'm a bit rusty. Oh, she responded well to my flirting, though. The only problem I'm having with this date is that every time I talk to her, she just kind of walks away. And now I don't actually know where she's gone. I'm starting to think maybe she just left. Maybe she's playing hard to get. I'm not sure she's really that interested in me. Maybe I'll try and make her laugh. And then when she's in a playful mood, it's a lot easier to turn things flirty. Okay, this is actually starting to go kind of well now. I feel like we should embrace, exchange numbers, and then flirt. We might just be able to get a first kiss out of this. Oh yeah, just a warm embrace. How about just a little kiss? Things are getting pretty suggestive. Is she gonna be open to a first kiss or is she just gonna give me a flat palm? What's it gonna be? Oh, sweet success. Oh, Sophia just gave video game level three at home. That might just be another scholarship on the cards. Okay, you know what? I'm going to end this date here. I think it went fairly well. We definitely have... So <laughs> date unsuccessful. We definitely have something going on. I'm going to send you home, trash bag dad, and then maybe we'll invite Libby over for dinner. Sophia can make a grand meal. She can meet the girls. It'll be great. Okay, Sophia, let's try and get you a bit further along on your video gaming skill. Currently level three. Let's see if we can get you to level five. She's got quite a few reward points. Maybe we'll see if we can get her something to build skills faster. <laughs> Secondhand smoke immunity. Okay, Sophia, you're gonna take a vacation day from school today, even though you've just had the weekend, because I want to see if you can apply for another scholarship. We just need one more. Okay, let's try the eSports one. See if maybe we can get this one. 
Right, trash bag, I'm thinking. Let's send a sexy text, or a happy text, I guess, to Libby. Then we'll take a bubble bath. Why don't you go do another painting, trash bag dad? Why are you so enraged, huh? Okay, I have an idea. Sophia, why don't you make a grand ham dinner? And then trash bag dad, once you finish your painting, maybe you can invite Libby over for dinner. Oh, she's already calling. I've been thinking to know, I've been thinking about getting to know Corbin Riddle better as a friend. No, you shouldn't do that, Libby. And then Tori, you can come and clean all this mess up. So we've got a nice clean space to have dinner. Oh, she could have two jobs at the same time. Oh, well, there you go. That's actually really handy to know. So you could play as a teenager with two side jobs. Oh, Libby's here. Let's go brighten her day. Can you two lovebirds not start flirting in Sophia's bedroom? That's pretty weird. Okay, let's all have dinner together. That's right, everyone, grab a plate, come sit down. Oh, see, this is nice. Oh, did you two change your mind? Turning your nose up at Sophia's food, or what's the deal there? You know what I might do? I might just get Sophia to go ahead and graduate school early. Just to free her up so that she can go ahead and apply to university. Hey, early graduates. Well, at least now you can apply to university. Let's see if we get accepted for a distinguished degree. Okay, well, I've done pretty much everything I want to do with Trash Bag Dad. So you guys, just do your own thing. Enjoy yourself for the next day or two. And I'll check in again when we get that acceptance letter. And maybe find out about the other scholarship. Okay, it's been a few days. We're going to check our university letter and see if we've been accepted yet. I hope so. I also did receive my scholarship letter, but I haven't checked it yet either. So we'll have to take a look. <gasps> Acceptance. Okay, but any distinguished degrees? Yes. It looks like she got accepted for quite a few distinguished degrees. Okay, this is the last acceptance one. Oh, we did not get it. <gasps> Ah, oh, so we only got two scholarships. Ah, oh, man. That really sucks. Well, let's just enroll in university anyway. We still got two scholarships. Not quite the three I wanted, but it's better than nothing. We'll do Brychester, and then we'll do a distinguished degree in culinary arts. And we'll do it from home. And, uh, oh yeah, you can see my scholarships there. Total cost, zero. That's right. And on that note, we've just enrolled in university, so I'm going to end this video here. I think this family are in a much better position than they were at the beginning of this in the last video. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with Trash Bag Dad's family. I hope you guys go on to live very fulfilling lives. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe, you know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.